What's up guys? Today I'm doing a video. Um, normally I just put images and I make some comments in it. But today is definitely time for the video. So I'm excited actually doing this individual suspension. I had a back problem a while ago and since I start using individual suspension, I will never go back to live axle. It's so comfortable. It's so sure, nice, right? So I am building this go-kart from scratch. I have videos on how I'm doing it. In this one, I just want to talk specifically about the aligning of the sprocket. It is extremely important. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to start talking about what do I do. First of all, I have to make sure the go-kart is level. That's the first thing. In everything I do, I make sure the go-kart is level. And since I'm working on the suspension in the back, I need to make sure that that it's level. I don't know if you could see it. It's extremely important. So now that I know that that is level, now I want to make sure that it's level also on the sprocket. So if I put the level on the sprocket, it should be level. Now, that that is done, now, if you see, I have a string here and it's barely touching there. So what does that do? I put the string from the back to the front, which is straight, and then I, if I go to the front, you're gonna realize that it's on the very center of the go car. That's how I know that the sprocket is actually aligned. And that is extremely important for a few reasons. The first one is that normally when it's not straight, the chain will damage the sprocket on one, one of the sides, depending where it's crooked. Also, the sprocket on the engine, that also damages the inner part of the engine, the, the, the shaft, because it's since it's crooked, it's, it puts more pressure towards the other side. So there's a few things that there are consequences of one simple mistake that we make. So that's why I wanted to make this video. So that's where I am right now. Hopefully I'll keep putting some other videos and I hope you guys like it. I hope. And um, well, see you guys soon in the next update.